Christmas everyone, it's LJ EST2004 here and today I'm going to show you two different versions of the 2002 movie about a boy. The VHS and the DVD, which respectively came out in 2003. So let me show what the VHS looks like. This is the front cover and it comes from the makers of Bridget Jones' Story and the producers of Meet the Parents. And it's based on the best-selling book by Nick Hornby. There's Will and Marcus on the front cover. It's rated M15 Plus that contains adult themes and low-level of course language. The catalogue number is 9029211. Here's the front, spine, profile picture of Will and Marcus, and a back. And it's a Universal Studios movie co-produced by Studio Canal and Working Title Films. <coughs> Here's the tape. And there's nothing special inside. And now I'm going to show you what the DVD looks like. It's got the same thing as the VHS, but the text from the makers of and the producers of are colored gray instead of red. And it's loaded with bonus material. And it's got the same rating and consumer advice as the VHS. The catalog number is 9038419. Here's the front, spine, same profile pictures as the VHS, and the back. The special features are feature commentary with Chris and Paul White, making up about a boy, deleted scenes with director's commentary, Badly Drawn Boy music videos, Born in the UK, Interview with Badly Drawn Boy, and DVD ROM features. Here's the disc with the wrong classification on it. Take a look. See? It's meant to be classified M15+, not MA. The same thing happened with the reprinted DVD of the Blue Max, with the full cover being the original one. So now it's time to compare. This is the front cover where it looks definitely the same, except for a few differences. And the spine, the VHS, the spine of VHS has the profile picture on the bottom of the title, while the, the spine of the DVD has it at the top. And uh, when we go to the back, the review says on the VHS, the funniest, smartest, and most winsome release so far this year, said Time Magazine, while the DVD does not. And uh, to check the runtime, both say 97 minutes. So they definitely look the same. Anyways, which version do you prefer better? The VHS or the DVD? Let me know in the comments. And I've got to say that Jeremy Snyder does not like this movie because he finds it too dramatic. As such, he's not going to get the DVD at all. Ever. So, that wraps up for today's video. So, do you like my content? Please make sure to comment, subscribe, and smash that like button. And after you've done it, you'll be notified when a new video is on my channel. So, I'll see you guys in my next DVD update.